Happy Vlogmas Day 13. So it's dark outside right now. It's about 5.45 and I'm at the Wellness Center. Yep, I'm making good with my commitment to get healthier and start exercising. So I have to be at work at 7 o'clock today, so let's get it done. Okay, so the first thing I should do is take some before pictures. At the gym, because yeah, I'm an exerciser. There's nobody here. It's like 5.45, a quarter to six. There were a lot of cars outside, but I'm the only one in here, so I'm thinking everybody's at a class. Okay, now let me do the back. There we go. All right, let's get warmed up. Okay, so 20 minutes on the treadmill and I went a mile. Let's go on to something else. Okay, so I did the quad exercise, 20 pounds and 20 reps. This is the one I did. Okay, the hamstring. 20 pounds, 20 reps. I think I did this one down here. Alright, it's getting busy in here. I did squats, 20 pounds, 20 reps. That's about what I'm going to start with. Well, that's kind of a bummer. I got called in to work early. It's 6.30. I have been here for 45 minutes, but I was hoping for a full hour. So I'm going to get dressed. I don't know if you could really hear what I was saying, so I'll add um, notes to the bottom so you can um, hear what I've been doing. And also, I'm not sure about the lighting in that room. So I'm going to do a quick body shot, real quick in this nice light, because I really want to see how well the exercising is doing for me and how well I'm progressing. Let's do a back shot. All right, there we go. So I'm not sure how often I should do these body shots to see my progress. And I am going to measure myself when I get home from work tonight. So maybe in a month, we'll revisit this and see how I'm doing. I started off a little bit slow, 20 minutes on the treadmill, um, 20 pound weights on three of those um, weight machines, and we'll just see how I do. All right, so here's my OMAD for the today. I have um, quite a few asparagus spears. I didn't weigh them out, but I'm pretty sure that's going to be near 100 grams that have already been roasted. And two chicken thighs. And that's it. And if I'm hungry later on, I'll probably have a little bit of cheese. But for right now, this is all I'm having today. Okay, so that's the end of my day. So it's too bad that while I was at the gym, I got called in to work a little bit early. I mean, it was only 15 minutes. But still, I was kind of bummed out because I was really into it. And I really had a plan of what I wanted to do. So I guess what I'm going to do, I, at first of all, I want to say that I've read all of your comments, your helpful hints and tips and everything. I haven't had a chance to respond back yet, but I have read everything and I've learned a lot. So thank you for all the tips that you guys have given me and I'll be responding back as soon as I can. My first priority tonight is to get to bed a lot earlier because the gym opens at 5.30. It took me half an hour to get ready for work. Well, half an hour to get ready for the gym and I had my work clothes packed in a bag and after I was done working out then I um, got ready for work in, at the gym because they have like a little dressing area kind of thing so um, anyway it took me a half an hour to get ready to go I had my stuff pre-packed and then by the time I got down to the gym it was already about a quarter to six so I really want to optimize that time the best that I can so my plan for tonight is to get to bed at about nine o'clock 
and I'd really like to wake up about 4.30. That way it gives me a half an hour, well, maybe 4.45. It'll give me a good half hour or more to um, get ready for the day and get down there. And I want to be at their doorstep, pounding it down right at 5.30 when they wake up because I'm going to have to be at work at 6.30 tomorrow. And that'll give me, um, I don't know, probably about... 45 50 minutes so my job is only like a block away from the gym they're really really close to each other so once I'm ready um, for the day I can get to work pretty fast so um, so that's it that's my plan I'm gonna work out for two days take a rest day work for two days and work out for two days and then two more rest days and then I'll start again on Monday. I'm going to do four days a week. I think that's a good start. And I was doing 20 everything. 20 minutes on the treadmill, 20 reps, 20 pounds. I just needed a base to go by and then I could increase as I need to. So today was my first day and I thought I did really well. Okay, so a random fact about me is um, I have a degree in early childhood education. I was a preschool teacher for 16 years when I lived in California. And um, when I moved to Utah, I couldn't find anything in this little town uh, in the preschool field. And so I ended up getting a job cooking and I started working at a senior center delivering Meals on Wheels. I worked at a restaurant cooking and now I um, cook and deliver meals to patients at a hospital. So I kind of fell into cooking um, when I moved to Utah. But I have a degree in early childhood education. That was probably my favorite job ever, was a preschool teacher. I loved that job. It was so much fun. So anyway, that's it for today. So until tomorrow, keep calm and keto on. Thank you.